What started as a Celtics fever dream ended in a nightmare. I mean, this series coming down to the fourth to decide who wins is seriously taking years off my life. I mean, it's always down to the wire. And tonight, it just wasn't in the Celtics' favor. Two calls changed it all, and then it was over. Milwaukee took the lead with a little over 10 seconds left and held on to it to take home the win, 110 to 107, making Game 6 a do or die on the road for the Celtics this Friday. They did to us what we did to them the last game at their place, so we just got to come back out and keep swinging. You know, we got to fight back, and that's just what it is. We don't have time to worry about how we lost. You know, they're a big physical team, and we've known that all series. Uh, we, we just got to be more aware of that, um, you know, hit bodies and uh, grab the ball. The Seas came out on fire in the first half with some of the best defense we've seen, period. Then came the start of the second half, the third 12 minutes of torture. The Celtics came out scattered. Defensive rebound issues led to mental mistakes, including Tatum settling for one too many threes when he just needed to take it to the rack. Uh, myself included settled for some threes and things like that instead of driving and attacking. The guys just needed to calm down and execute, and there were glimmers of that in the fourth. But the Celtics' glaring 17 offensive rebounds and some questionable calls gave Milwaukee late life and put the nail in the Celtics' Game 5 win column. Offensive rebound. We box out, we win that game. You know, and that's what it ultimately comes down to. They, they did a good job of getting um, their team uh, extra shots, and, and, and they hit them, and, and they made us pay. So got to do a better job on that end and clean that up. and. You know, and that's just what it is. Like I said, like you said, they're the defending champs. They made some championship plays, and now we got to respond. But despite the loss, the best moment of the game was watching Father Time turn back the clock once again. I mean, that clutch outback slam, no words. Well, actually, four words. Playoff foul for president. Until game six, reporting from TD Garden, Alexei Ifredo, the Boston Herald.